everywhere. True positives, true negatives, false positives, and false negative. They are very important that you have to understand when yeah, you are dealing with some machine learning models, basically classification models. So this is one kind of evaluation metric we use in machine learning. So very quickly, we are going to understand what are true positive, true negative, then false positive and false negative. You can see here in this table, actual and predicted, right? So, well, first, before coming to this, let me first have a discussion of these terms with some examples. Say we are building a classification model. We are building a classification model to determine if a patient has cancer or not. Okay. So, in this case, the purpose of our model is to try to predict if a patient has cancer. The positive outcome would be if a patient has cancer, understandably, the negative outcome would be if a patient does not have cancer. Now, true positive. True positive, shortly TP, are positive outcomes that the model predicted correctly. This means if the patients who are predicted to have cancer by the model indeed does have the cancers. So you got it, no? Means suppose our machine predicted that Five number of patients uh, means have cancer, but um, means uh, by the model, then of course they have cancer. Then that will be true positive, right? Then true negatives are the negative outcomes that the model predicted correctly. Means the patients who are predicted to be healthy by our machine indeed does not have cancer means they really don't have cancer and also the machine predicted correctly that they are healthy so they will become true negatives then false positive fp they are the positive outcomes that the model predicted incorrectly okay got it now the model predicted incorrectly and they this false positives is also known as type 1 error remember type 1 error so in our example what happens that the num the patients who were predicted to have cancer were actually healthy means our machine predicts that this number of patients or this patient uh, means uh, have has cancer but exactly that patient is healthy Right, so machine actually predicted incorrectly, or machine give a uh, false positive outcome. Got it now? This is a type one error. Then false negatives are the negative outcomes that the model predicted incorrectly, and this false negative is also known as type two error. Type two error means what? So in our case, what happens? The patients who were predicted to be healthy actually had cancer. Means our machines, our machine learning model predicted that this patient is healthy. But what happened actually that the, that patient is uh, means that patient has cancer. So that is a false negative outcome. Well, let me quickly summarize. True positives means the model predicted correctly. Means the model predicts that this patient has cancer but and this person has cancer and that person really has cancer right then true negative means the mo model predicted correctly that they don't have uh, that particular disease that the means the person who who is predicted when who was uh, is predicted to be healthy indeed he doesn't have cancer then true uh, false positive that is also known as type 1 error means that the model predicted incorrectly model says that this patient has cancer but that patient is re actually healthy then false negative means model predicted incorrectly that the person does not have uh, cancer or the patient is healthy but actually that person uh, has cancer so that are the true positive true negative false positive that is type one error false positive and false negative type two error well Let's consider this particular matrix. Uh, remember, this matrix is known as this matrix is known as confusion matrix. Okay, 
don't go by the term. This is confusion matrix, but actually it clears the confusion, right? And this is a very well-known term in the area of machine learning, basically classification, right? Now, here in this confusion matrix, the column represents the rows uh, that present the number of predicted values and the columns that present the actual values for each class, the two columns, like right? this is positive and negative. There are 500 total instances. So you will see that these are the actual values, positive and negative, and these, uh, these are the predicted values. Sometimes you will see that predicted values come this side, actual values come this side. Don't go, um, it's a very simple thing to get understood, right? Now, positive, two positive, two negative. So in this case, what happened? This is predicted value positive and this is the actual value positive. So this will become, means seven will become true positive. Sim similarly, this is uh, predicted negative and this is real negative. So you will see that this, this particular, let me mark this, 480. This falls under this particular column and this is the cross section or with this column. This is the actual negative and also predicted negative. So 480 is the what? True negative, right? Positive. True positive is the means that machine predicted correctly that seven is positive and also actual value is also seven. So that is predicted correctly. So two positive is seven, true negative is 480. But negative means the machine predicted that five is the negative, but actual value that is positive, right? So what will happen? That is the false negative, right? Similarly, this also you can say what is this exactly. Okay, let me clear this so that you can have a clear look of this table. See, two positive seven, two negative 480, false positive eight, false negative five. See, this is negative, right? This negative means machine predicted as negative, but actually they are positive. So what will happen? That is the false negative. Similarly, the machine predicted eight as positive, but they are not actually positive. They are negative in actual value. So false negative, right? False negative will be eight. Okay. Uh, sorry. Uh, the, uh, yeah, got it. So this table is clear to you. This is the prediction. True positive, right? True, true means this set also true. If actual value is also true. Positive value, uh, patient predicted positive. So that is also true. So true positive. Similarly, this is negative side. So this machine predicted negative as 480 and actual also 480. So this is will be, this will be what? True negative. Okay. Then machine predicted as 5 as negative, but actually they are what? Actually they are um, positive. Right. So if, um, what is the value? 5. So 5 will be what? This is actually uh, false negative. Why? Because they are positive, but machine predicted as negative. So that this will be, um, uh, what happens? That false positive. So similarly, this one is eight. Okay, so I hope it is clear to you. Let me clear this. Well, got it now. So true positive is seven, true negative is 480, and then false uh, negative is, false negative is how much? Five, FN five. And this is again uh, machine predicted positive, but actually they are negative. So what will happen that that is is false positive, false positive because machine predicted false, right? Machine predicted uh, positive as false, so that will be false positive. So, okay, so again, this is machine predicted negative falsely because actually they are positive, so that will be false negative. Okay, so got it. So these are the predicted values. So don't confuse. Whenever this site predicted and this are actual, sometimes you will get that actual comes here and prediction comes here. But thing is that true positive and true negative depends on suppose whatever the machine predicted, suppose positive, but actually positive. So positive machine predicted, so that is truly positive. So that is that becomes truly positive. Similarly, negative machine predicted negative, but that is positive. So machine predicted falsely. So false negative. Okay. Similarly, positive this side. Machine predicted positive, right? But actually they are negative. So that will be false positive, right? So this one is false positive because machine predicted 
positive, but that is false. False positive. Similarly, machine predicted negative, negative, right? But that is true negative because exactly that is also uh, actual value is negative. So uh, that will be true negative. Got it? So whatever the machine predicted, in front of that value, either put true if it is truly positive, I mean, truly um, happening in the actual case also. And if it is negative, if it is uh, correct means in actual value that is also negative then that is true negative otherwise machine predicted negative but that is actually positive so falsely negative and machine predicted positive like 8 but actually negative so that is false positive so that way you have to no means nomenclature these things this confusion matrix now I think I have discussed in details uh about this confusion matrix also and then positive values true positive true negative and false positive false negative so i think don't you don't have any doubt on that still you have doubt then you can ask me remember type one error is the false positive means those things which are machine predicted as positive but actual values false actual value is not positive so that is false positive that is type one error and type 2 error means false negative, means machine may break the negatives, but actually they are positive. So that will become false negative. So type 2 error is false negative. I'm again calling, yeah, again, uh, means summarizing these two type 1 error, type 2 error. Type 1 error means false positive. Type 2 error means false negative. Well, I hope this is clear to you now. Okay. Thank you.